Hey, what's up guys? Mr. Free Coiner coming back to you again. Hope you're all doing well and taking care of yourselves. Now, yes, I know it has been a while. I have definitely been slacking on making content. There's a reason for it. And uh, you know what? It, it's all good. It's all good. Um, I have not gone away completely. And I'm not going to. I'm going to definitely put... Uh, put something out here and there. If if I don't come back completely, it'll be at least like this. So, guys, definitely want to apologize for being so absent, but sometimes you got to do what you got to do. Either way, just remember this. I'm not giving any type of financial advice, so don't take it as that. I'm simply sharing my thoughts and opinions. All right, so the last time I did video, I think uh, the price of XRP was sitting around 23 cents, 23 and a half, something like that. Um, and we've come up quite a bit. Now, I'm sure you guys have been keeping your eyes on Twitter, on different articles that have been coming out. And we're seeing a lot of articles basically calling for a bull run. Okay, it's going to happen very soon, just like I've said before it's not going to take years it'll happen i mean there were a lot of things that had to be put in place before this could happen uh and it just as you can see you look at the economy look at uh the impeachment situation uh coronavirus there are all these puzzle all, rather all these chess pieces have to be put in the right place before this type of thing can happen now my prediction on this guys is that the price prices of pretty much everything all this crypto is it, it's going to take a huge and very sharp uh, uh turn upward okay what this is going to do is keep more of the general public from jumping in right now in the in this particular uh phase of uh of the price ranges you know price changing rather uh, so we'll still right now there are a lot of people kind of taking a look and i'm sure some of you might know some people that are sitting back going well i mean you're saying that it's going to do this but it's really not doing anything and they don't really get it they don't they don't understand that once it already once it takes off it's too late Right. They they want confirmation that it's going to do something because that hundred dollars they're going to put into it. They just cannot lose it. Right. They just. Oh, my God. If I put a hundred dollars in this and I lose it, I, I don't know what I'm going to do. So they, they are going to be the fodder when it comes to crypto, when these prices go up and they are, you know, yeah, we're, we're going to have a pullback, but it won't pull back here. I mean, because think about. Uh, we'll say five years ago, okay, five, six years ago, have we returned to those types of prices? Uh, for the most part, no. I mean, we've had some dips kind of close to it, but it hasn't returned there. And I think uh, that, well, not I think that all of that was based on speculation. Now we are moving into a phase where crypto is essentially going to be uh, majorly moved through utility okay yeah not all coins like bitcoin have high utility but every crypto has some type of utility okay not as evident as xrp but you got to look at vet you got to look at even casino coin they have uh definitely have some uh, partnerships that are already signed vet same way pundi x uh, so many different coins are are you know be are going to be used by different sectors and different types of businesses that uh we have to call this new bull this next bull run a utility at least a partial utility bull run yes speculation is going to pay, play a huge part in this a lot, all the people right now that are sitting on the sidelines afraid to put their hundred dollars in they're the ones who are going to fuel the the uh, the really high highs of this next bull market so it is what it is that that's just how it works works we are those people 
for the people that got in five, six years ago. Okay. But we just got in still, we're still in that sweet spot. This next run, obviously it won't be the same. Anyway, um, just wanted to show you guys a couple articles. Uh, and also I do want to uh, definitely, I know I'm, a, I'm quite late on this, but, uh, the situation with, uh, Kobe, uh, the reason I want to mention this is simply because right before that happened, my, vi in my video, I had said that one thing we all need to do is definitely concentrate or at least take the time to, uh, spend, spend some time with our loved one, right? To tell, you know, just, just make sure that we put that energy, put some of our energy into that because we, we're not promised tomorrow. We're not promised uh, I mean, the next five minutes, to be honest with you, we have to be aware that at any time we or someone we love can be taken away from us, uh, you know, or we could be taken from them. So it's just really, really smart to express how you feel and, and spend that time that you need and just, you know, slow down and, and sit back every now and then. So anyway, uh, just wanted to make a comment about that. Okay, so I'll go ahead and get into a couple of these articles. Not going to go through reading them or anything like that. Uh, you'll get the point here. So we got here, uh, XRP and XRP is intense. 750 day bear market is about to end. Fireworks imminent. Uh, so, I mean, it just, this happened. I mean, this is several different articles saying just about the same thing. XRP price can hit all new time. I'm sorry. All time high in 2020. I had 750 day bear market is slowly ending. Uh, XRP just broke above its multi year, you know, on and on. This is like uh, actually uh, earlier today. But anyway, guys, the the uh, media is calling for a bull run. Now, will it happen tomorrow? I mean, nobody knows. Nobody knows when this is going to happen. Yeah, we've had some a lot of these silly predictions. Uh, two thousand dollars, or was it like the other day, or something like that? It, you know, the deal is, as I've always said, I think all of these different price price points are very, very possible. But nobody, no one in this space can predict what's going to happen, or rather, uh, uh, how high the price is going to get at a specific time. Nobody has that ability. There are, you know, just, there are just a lot of factors going on. There is manipulation. There is uh, speculation still happening. There is the utility portion that uh, still needs to fully kick in. A lot needs to happen before we see prices like that. Me personally, I mean, I, I'm, I, I don't need it to get there just to feel good. I mean, honestly, um, it, just seeing it go to 25 cents, that definitely is not a not a game changer but hey it's something that uh is moving it, it gives you the a, a positive feeling about this right um even though we're down from where we were for so long uh yeah so anyway any positive movement movement to me is definitely good movement <clears throat> okay now just remember this guys Remember this. Now, I know in my last video, uh, I said something similar to this, and it got me a kind of shadow banned. I, they they definitely cut my legs out from under me. I think I don't I don't I haven't even looked at it. Uh, but last time I looked checked my video, it was only I think like 760 views or something like that. Um, YouTube is hey YouTube's YouTube. I mean, there's heavy censorship there uh, for whatever reason. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm sure there are certain things that they don't want the general public to uh, to know. And when you start talking about these things on a platform that anyone could potentially come across, uh, they they want to limit how far reaching this information is. And, and again, not that I was sharing anything seriously groundbreaking. It's just the suggestions that um, can, you know cause these I guess these algorithms to start to um, restrict the video now the deal is is when you look at this coronavirus thing right you look at the hype that's being put on it 
Again, I'm not saying that it isn't a real thing, okay? I'm not saying that there aren't people, you know, expiring due to it. What I'm saying is that the hype being generated around it is, is a good distraction from what is actually happening right now. We have also the impeachment, right? Which, it, it, I, whether it's positive or negative, it's more distraction from what's, uh, what's really important. And that is the move that's being made on the economy, the global economy. Okay. Things are about to change. And a lot of people in the world are totally, not a lot, damn near everyone. They're totally unprepared. They have no information about it. Uh, you, you know, you have your people that are, like I said, just afraid to put even $5 in it because they don't, they, they don't want to lose five dollars. I mean, but yet they'll go and go to a casino or uh, spend a hundred and two hundred dollars on uh, a lottery ticket. It, it just it, it the psyche of most people. It's just it's really not rational. But the fact of the matter is, uh, the I'll say the powers that be don't want these people to put their money in something that will absolutely and can actually grow. That's my take on it. Am I absolutely right? Hell, I don't know. That's just from what I see. I don't see why certain things that happen, happen. It, it just, it doesn't make sense. If, if there isn't something more behind it, why go the route that uh, they go, right? Because we know uh, YouTube is definitely an in a, in a, in a NSA project, okay? Just like Google just like, uh, I mean, pretty much everything that we deal with, it's all used to spy on us, right? So, um, anyway, I'm not going to go down that rabbit hole. <laughs> it's pretty deep. But, anyway, guys, just remember this. The things that are being put in your face, and I'm sure a lot of you already know this. The things that are being thrown in your face on a daily basis, these are lies. These are myths that are, um, are being put out there. You have to search for the truth. The truth does not uh, get revealed, right? It gets it gets pushed down. It gets pushed back and covered up. Just remember that. So if you find some obscure, crazy thing that seems totally impossible, it's very likely that thing is the truth, all right? Just something that I have come to realize. Anyway, guys... I really hope you guys are doing well. I really appreciate all of your, uh, I mean, really, your 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 support and your concern and, and all of that. I, I really, really appreciate that. I'm, I'm telling you, I, I, I mean, man, it's, it's kind of weird when you have people asking, hey, are you okay? I haven't heard from you. You know, people that I've never seen before, I, I don't know from Adam. You know, and I really appreciate that. And I'm, and my concern is for all of you guys as well. Uh, just remember this: even if I'm not making uh, videos or anything like that, I'm standing here right next to you guys, and and uh, you know, I'm going through it right there with you. And if there's anything that I can do, uh, I will absolutely do it. Uh, again, I really appreciate you guys. So uh, let's just stick with it. Let's stay focused. And keep on this. So with that being said. Thank you for joining me today. This has been Mr. Free Corner. Take care of yourselves. And God bless.